Dear Heavenly Father, You love us. You show Your mercy towards all of us every moment of our life. As Your grace has made you and me to see the light of yet another new day in our life as we have begun this new day with your help we humbly plead you dear god to accompany us in all the plans or activities we do we do today may all those activities and plans may be done in remembering your power you are strength in our lives and all those activities and plans help us to grow a step deeper into the presence of you as the word of god of today's liturgy reminds us that we all of us are tenants or co-workers in the vineyard of the lord and we need to accept that god is the owner and he is the one who has uh, placed with generosity all of us to work in his vineyard and whoever come to work in the name of god in this vineyard we being co-workers need to respect them need to take their guidance and in no way we hurt them or hit them bang them or kill them but if we do so then definitely we will face the consequence as the gospel of today tells us when we are given responsibility or the talents and gifts we need to use them they are not for our selfish gain but for the common good we all have responsibility to see the growth of not so much of ourselves but of others we are here for others not for ourselves if jesus came thinking about us how much more we need to think about the good of others if jesus did not become man in this world and did not live like any one of us then we would have been sins and we would have not received salvation similarly we need to accept what god and jesus has done in your and my life and accordingly we need to take seriously what to be done for the growth of the kingdom of god amidst us among us and around us dear friends let us not neglect to hear the word of god and to change our ways and lent is given as a right season to mend our ways and to transform our lives in every way for the good of ourselves and for the good of others and for the good of the kingdom of god if we fail to work in the kingdom of god or the vineyard of the lord we will be removed from the vineyard of the lord meaning we will not have a place in the kingdom of heaven or the heavenly paradise in this world as long as we live let us think about to how to enter the heavenly paradise finally our goal is to reach to that place from where we came from dear friends let us know the seriousness of our life and always respect one another love one another care one another and no way we will hurt anyone because everyone is the image and likeness of god
the Lord be with you and with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Wishing you all a wonderful and great Friday today.